Ladies and gentlemen, welcome everybody to a brand new vlog. This is going to be a weird vlog, to be honest with you guys. Um, as you guys have seen from the title and the thumbnail, I, I'm away on vacation, or I was actually. Why it, this video is weird is because I recorded this, this introduction and a couple of the recordings between the videos. I'm going to record right now, and it now is actually a couple of weeks after the vacation. So I actually forgot to record a couple of videos during the holiday. But I'm doing it now for you guys, I'm going to add them into the video, just a couple of videos just to talk to you guys throughout the vacation. Now I'm actually in my room as you guys can see, it's actually raining outside, I'm standing in this corner here because the room is very hot. And there's cool air coming through here but it's also raining, I can't say if you can see. It's actually raining outside now, this is our backyard. It just stopped raining. That's actually weird, the rain, uh, the couple of days in this week, I mean it's actually Friday now, the couple of days when it rained, it rained in uh, like a specific a specific sequence, like a couple of minutes, okay, like this, this afternoon it was like sunlight, it was, it was extremely hot and now it is like so cloudy, um, it's, it, it, it rains in a sequence, so for five minutes it storms and then next five minutes it stops like this dead silent and then after for, after that five minutes there's another five minutes or ten minutes doesn't matter but it, 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 it comes in an interval of different minutes and then it starts raining and it stops raining so so it changes every time so there's not a consistent amount of rain that falls for one minute it's going to start raining for next minute it stops so it changes every time but we're actually joined with the cat today um she's actually afraid of the rain outside so she's hiding in my room um but she's not really hiding because the Draining again. And yeah. It's raining outside again. It wasn't even one minute. And then it stopped raining. Now it stopped again. Almost. But okay, so we joined with the cat today. She's actually hiding, you guys can see. But what's going to happen today is I'm going to talk to you this introduction of the vacation I was on. Um, what I'm going to do is this is the introduction and then I'm going to go edit the videos and put out the videos where I need to talk to you guys or what I'm going to be up to for the day. I'm going to talk to you guys in this manner. It is after the uh, vacation but it's still going to be in the same way as you, as you guys can see a normal vlog. And then hopefully you guys will enjoy it just as I did uh, enjoy the vacation. But I'm going to edit the video now, add these uh, couple of videos into it, see where, see where I need missing parts and I'm going to add them to it. But hopefully guys, you, uh, hopefully you guys will still enjoy it. So the first introduction or the first couple of videos that we're going to be at the road trip onto the vacation is not going to be that far, it's a six hour drive. So um, it's not going to be that long, I'm just going to show you a couple of videos on the way there and then I'll see you guys in another video after the road trip. But if you guys do enjoy, if you do, smash that thumbs up button. And without further ado, let's get to the road trip.
Alright, so we have finally arrived. It was a six hour journey, which is really not that bad. But quick story. So what happened was, I had a Samsung Galaxy Note 5. If you don't know what the phone is, I'm going to show you a picture of it right now. It was a good phone, a really good phone. I don't have any problems with it. It had a really good camera. But the only problem is it fell and the screen got damaged and it's not usable anymore. So now I have this small Samsung Galaxy Ace Neo. It's just a really small phone just to stay connected to the friends and family. Now what that phone is mostly for is just to stay connected. It's not a big phone, not that fancy phone. It's just a normal phone just to stay connected with the friends and family by call, SMS or WhatsApp. I don't really have that much things on that phone. So it's not that good phone, but it, it, it does help me extremely a lot. Now what happens is sometimes if I didn't have this camera I'm talking to you guys now on me, I had to record with something and that phone was something I had on me. So I had to record with that phone every now and then. So it's not going to be that good quality, but I still hope you enjoy it. So that is the story, just to give you guys a quick heads up. All right, so basically, main thing is we didn't really re arrived on a Saturday, so we didn't really do much the Saturday and the Sunday, so I didn't really record anything that two days. But the next video or the next part is going to be on a Monday. It was the first time or the first, let's say, the first time of that or a holiday that we were at the beach and I was recording to my, with my phone. So here we go. We are now on our way to the beach. We are, I'm recording with my phone right now because the camera is somewhere else. But we are just at the beach right now. Really excited. So now I'm just going to give you a short preview of how it looks over here. You can see, you can see, you can see, you guys can see me a little bit better now. But here it is, let me show you the beach. that cold. See, I thought the cold, the sea would be a lot colder, but it isn't really that cold. Okay, I've changed my mind. It's really cold. Lift the ground. Hey, you come back. I want to give you a chance. Love me like you used to, so we can learn again. The skin is getting round, maybe drinking that away. Maybe we will not regret it. You will not regret it. Alright, so now we are done at the beach. Uh, we just have to go and clean ourselves up. Our feet is really dirty. But uh, we have to go and clean ourselves up, then we're heading back home and uh, we're just gonna calm down for the, for the evening. The next day. Alright, so this is going to be the next day. Now, there was actually a golf course at uh, nearby the beach. Actually, it's where you go on holiday to, to visit the beach, but then you go at golf. So anyway, um, there was a golf course at the beach, and the time it was really cloudy, and it wasn't really a good time to go at the beach because it's going to be it's going to be rainy and all those things. Not really good weather to go to the beach. We decided to go to uh, the golf course. So me and my brother, we went. Uh, actually, the whole group, me and my brother and my girlfriend, as well as my brother's girlfriend and my father. We were at the holiday, we went to the golf course and then we hit a, uh, hit a couple of balls. Me and my brother, we like hitting golf balls, it's a good sport, it's a, a, a calming sport but I really enjoy it as a hobby, I'm not looking at it to do professional but I like playing a golf a couple of times, hitting a couple of balls, especially going to the golf course. But that's none of the business. Now we're going to the golf course, I'm quickly going to show you a quick compilation of 
a let's say a compilation, a fast forward video or just a quick video of a couple of balls I hit. the next day so we are going to the cheese farm now we are going to grab some food and then we're going to walk around see what's here everything and then later on i'm going to show you how it really looks the, the place has changed a lot um, it's actually really beautiful but i'll show you guys later They did upgrade the place when we were last year. The wooden stairs or the bridge over there, over the swimming pool, wasn't there last year. But it's actually a really nice place. We got some food, we got some takeaways, and this is how it looks on the other side. Now, just to give you guys an example, it really looks beautiful over here. Last year, there were no no trees over there. There was nothing. So they really uh, planted some a lot of trees, and it really looks a lot greener now. So it is really really good. It, it goes well with the environment. It, very, it looks really green. So uh, this is also a playground downstairs, you can also play putt putt as well. Um, it's actually really nice down there. There's a small farm on that side of the day where you can actually feed some goats and all those uh, animals. And there's a playing area right over there. So I think this will be it for now. We are just gonna go and walk around, look what place there is else, and then uh, if there's anything else, this bird, this bird, a lot of, you get a lot of birds that actually attack you when you want to uh, rub their head, but this bird actually runs around. Look at this. Hello. She actually runs around. Alright, so we're done at the cheesecake factory. Apparently, it's like a cheesecake, it's a farm, she's found farm. Now, just to give you guys an example, that is where we parked our but We parked our car right over there. That is the cheese farm. Now, over this side is a lot of trees. Now, in the movies, you, you get that old movies that happen on a farm. Just to show you guys this view. Look at that view. It's so beautiful. There's a lot of trees over here. I just had to come here to this side, just this side, just to experience the view and the environment. It's a lot windy out here, but it's worth the while. Okay, so we are done here at the cheese farm. We are now on our way back home. And uh, I think we are going to probably the wind is actually making my hair. So weird. Okay, so now we're going heading back home and then I think we're going to probably walk through St. Lucia, maybe check out, check out all the shops. And uh, I am going to show you guys a few of the shops. But we are done here, so now we're heading back home and just, uh, just to see what's going to happen. Okay, I could broke
Okay, so it's the next day today. It's a beautiful day today, so today is going to be a long day. We are going out to Cape Varla. I will record everything as much as possible, but there's a lot of things to see. So without further ado, come along with me and I'll show you what everything is at Cape Varla. Okay, so the lookout point was over there. We just came from all the way over here, and this is the other side. That is the ocean. There are some more zebras. Right over there. But, that is the ocean. Now, apparently, they say that if you look closer, you will see whales. But I've been here a couple of times and I haven't really seen them, so. Really beautiful outlook. Okay, so we are done at the outlook. It's really beautiful. I'm glad we were there. Now, next stop is going to be Mission Rocks. That's what they call it. It's extremely beautiful. I'm going to show you when we're there, and then you'll look, you, you, when you see it, you'll know why it's called Mission Rocks. at Mission Rocks. I'm going to show you guys right now. This time of the day, it's low tide, so the water is really low. Now, last year, we when it was high tide, um, and the water was even came in. So I am actually standing on the very edge, the far edge of this Mission Rocks. But I'm going to record, and I'm going to go a little bit closer for you guys to uh, record a little bit more. But it is really, really nice over here. It's beautiful. Just a whole image of some rocks and water. It is a really, really beautiful place to be. And it's you have to go to the ocean rocks if you can. But um, as I said, it's the ocean right over there. You guys can see the ocean. And it's going to be all the ocean rocks. And that is why it's called mission rocks. I don't know why it's called mission rocks. Uh, it is because of rock and it's like it's on a mission. Um, so that's probably it. But there's also a lot of crabs around here. There is crabs. So if I'm going to catch, see a crab, I'm going to show you guys. I do have my GoPro here as well. So if I'm going to go get closer and record some more uh, underwater images or videos for you guys, I will definitely do so. But I'm going to get closer to the water for you guys and uh, just enjoy the just enjoy. The
ją So that was Mission Rocks. It was really beautiful and what experience. So next stop, and I think that's probably gonna be the final stop, is going to be Cape Vidal's beach itself. Um, if there's anything on the way that I want to show you guys, I will record it. But until then, I'll see you guys at the beach. So the next part is going to be more at the end of the holiday. There was a nature reserve park nearby, so we decided to go there and record and record a couple of videos of the different animals as well as a couple of pictures. But I'm quickly going to show you just a couple of videos I did the different animals I saw there, and most of all, I'm just going to quickly show you guys what was there, what we saw, everything, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this part.
we're just here at the curio shop just to grab something to eat and then we are off back on the road to find more animals. Okay, it is the last day or the second last day. We are here. Uh, it is just past five, almost 20 past five right now. So the sun is going down. The sun isn't actually out now. So it is the last day. Tomorrow morning we are leaving, going back to Pretoria. So we are just here at the beach for the last time to say our goodbyes and probably see it next year maybe again. I got some cans or whatever you call it to uh, grab some presents. So I'm going to finish the things off here and I'm going to record a couple of more episodes or videos for uh, for the ocean or the beach. Last couple of videos and uh, then we're going to go and say our goodbyes and other than that I will see you guys right now. Okay, I must say we are at the beach like in half, like in half an hour now and from the difference between the first day we were here and the last time right now is the wind. There's actually absolutely no wind on this beach today. It is extremely, extremely calm and I must say the wind is, there's actually no wind. So it's actually a really good time to be here except for the time of day. Uh, it's a little bit late so there's not really much to do here. You can't really swim because the water is a little bit too cold. Um, but it's actually really beautiful, the wind isn't really blowing and it's actually a really fun time to be here. So comparing the, the, the first day we were here as well as this day, uh, it's a complete difference. So it is actually a really nice time to be here. Uh, the only problem is it is a little bit too cold as well as the sun, there's no sun actually. But oh, uh, comparing the wind, um, it's a perfect time. Alright, so this is going to be the end of this vlog. I'm actually looking a little bit different now since the last piece I've recorded for the vlog. It was actually, I think, just before the nature reserve. Um, but it doesn't matter. This is going to be the end, unfortunately. I have really have enjoyed the whole experience of being at the beach, the whole holiday and vacation. I have really enjoyed. Just another thing where I've started off with a visitor. We are going to end it off with another visitor. She is still here. She has joined us from the beginning till the end and while I was recording everything and editing everything she was here the whole time supporting me and I really really uh, really appreciate her being with me. So this is going to be, end, be the end of this vlog. I really hope you guys have enjoyed it just as I have. The vacation, the whole holiday was an amazing experience. I really enjoyed it. I like going to the beach. It's a different place to be and the whole atmosphere and everything is just so so beautiful and I really enjoyed it. Now the most the basic or the most funnable or the best experience of them all of that whole beach of the whole week was the time the whales was there from the four or five times I've been at the beach the refer that was the first time we actually saw all the whales now just to give you guys an example the beach they were or where I was recording the whales you could actually swim inside it now there's some beaches that is a little bit dangerous to swim so you, you have to swim at your own risks but that beach was made for you guys to swim but the only reason there wasn't so many people is because there was a high shore the uh, the high the water was a high tide so there was actually a little bit further into the water was a lot of rocks so it would have been a little bit dangerous swimming because if the waves take you or push you 
there's a possibility that you might hit a rock and you get extremely much, extremely much damage to your body but uh, just the whole idea of thinking that there was whales that at a seen distance and you could actually swim in that beach so the possibility was high that you would actually get a lot closer to the whales even if they could get a little bit closer to you there was a possibility that you, you would actually swim with the whales so that was an amazing experience i really didn't think it would be possible and i don't really think i would see whales until today or until the vacation so that was the most fantastic experience for me personally if you guys have also enjoyed a part you can guys let me know but that was personally for me the most experienced part of it all um, and my my, my vacation or my uh, birthday was also actually in the week we were there all right so to end off everything the experience was amazing the finger vacation was amazing the experience of seeing the whales that close and just seeing actually the whales for the very first time it was an amazing experience and I really have enjoyed so I hope you guys have enjoyed this small not actually small but a really quick vlog of my vacation if you guys would like to see more vlogs let me know hit, hit the thumbs up button if you'd like to see more vlogs um, I really enjoyed creating the vlogs I really like recording the vlogs like this and most of all I really enjoy editing the vlogs going through every video I've recorded and just making it fun so I really hope you guys have enjoyed if you'd like to see more vlogs as well let me know hit the thumbs up button if you have enjoyed this vlog as well and to miss and not to miss out on any other video go and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you stay updated to my channel for every video coming up but this is going to be the end of this vlog i hope you guys have enjoyed either i have extremely much editing going through the holiday visiting the beach seeing whales and editing this vlog was amazing i really have enjoyed so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys have enjoyed and i'll see you guys in a brand new video goodbye